Okay, so like, I know we haven't talked in a really long time, and I know sometimes like that bothers you or whatever, but you know me well enough to know that I work better alone, and it's not that I don't want to talk to you, it's just like I've been really busy lately, like, I don't know, like listening to music and spending long amounts of time in the Walmart parking lot because I have so much anxiety, I don't really want to go in. And then, like, I just spend time on my phone in the Walmart parking lot, and then I just go home without actually going into Walmart. So, that's what I've been up to other than working. And so, so with that being said, I have missed you. And I'm so happy that you called me to get your makeup done today because, let's face it, honey, you need me. So, I'm going to go ahead and start with your eyebrows and tell me what you've been up to lately I think it's so like good that you like have job where people really love you and I really feel like people want to be around me more but it's just this thing I have like it's like I love people but at the same time people it's like what the fuck with people you know I don't really know how to explain it but I really admire that about you like I love how you're so good with people and just how people like kind of flock to you and how you embrace them and I will too but it's kind of like after we had our time, like, after I meet you, and it's like, oh, this is so great, butterflies and rainbows, it's kind of like, fuck, what else? So, I don't really know, it's like, I just kind of like admire you in a way. Yeah. because I'm always more attracted to energies that are like more extroverted it's the weirdest thing like when I'm with other introverts it's great but the shit gets boring sometimes you know it's like what the fuck I listen to music and sit in Walmart parking lots by myself I don't really need friends to do that with so like whenever I have friends like friend friends like I always have extroverted friends, like the friends who are always gonna go out and who are always in the thick of things. And so when I really need to be around people, like I go and hang out with them. So it's like the weirdest thing, like how opposites of attract. I just feel like the only people that really understand me are like my mom and my sisters. And it's because like I'm kind of like weird as fuck, and that's okay because my whole thing is everybody's always trying to find different ways to be different. But like when you are actually different, then you get called weird or whatever the fuck. But that's okay because 
all the regular people are going to be less memorable. And even if they are memorable, they're going to be just as memorable as the last 20 people that came in. So it's still like the person that just came in. I'm too smart for my own good. That's the problem. Well, I know it's not like this is a thing. Like sometimes, like I get friends to call me. It's like, why haven't I heard of you? Heard of you? Heard from you in so long? And it's like I think about the people that I don't call every day. Like I think about them multiple times every single day. But that doesn't mean I want to talk to you. Like I can miss you, and I can want to be around you, and I can think about being around you. And reminiscing about our good times, but like it's not like I actually want it. <laughs> I think only other introverts will understand because I, like I said, I work so much better by myself. I'm so in my head. This thing I was gonna mention you to know about me is that I get shit done and I'm a bad bitch, and that I love you, and so we have not. Love you and I miss you and you are one of my best friends. So I don't want you to think just because we don't talk like we're not like friends because we are fucking close. You know I used to love going out to the club. I just think like as I've gotten older, I've just been so much less interested in things that don't really serve me or like my goals, you know? I really wanna be around people that have similar interests to me and goals. So Even though some people may seem extroverted, it doesn't always mean they're extroverted because I know you mentioned like how we used to go out and I used to talk to everybody and it's like, yeah, because duh, I'm drunk. I can talk to anybody when I'm drunk, just like most people. That's why most people drink because we just want to be more social without feeling judged. But that doesn't really mean that we're extremely like extroverted and I feel like a lot of people You know, really, the literally, the literally, the literally, the only person I talk to every day is like my mom. But I really want to learn like how to become more extroverted. But then, like, whenever people try to teach me, it's like, fuck no, I'm an introvert.
I'm gonna go ahead and do my foundation. I guess too. Why well, I have you here? Because I know you like a huge social butterfly, socialite, and knows everybody. So, like, what tips would you have for me? I'm missing it, but I'm just gonna start. I'm very appreciative for you. Now, I'm going to go ahead and do my concealer. for me. Oh my god, does your mom like hate your mom? Like, does your mom like, I don't know. I remember when you talked about like your other friends before and she was like, well, how are you guys even friends? Like when you only talk like once a year. I remember that and I was like, dang, I hope your mom doesn't think like I'm a fake friend just because I love from afar as opposed to like being like in your face but then like right now I just wanted to make sure I didn't think like I was like I don't know that's another thing I really think people don't think about introverts like introverts we really do care about what other people think of us like it's like we don't give a fuck but when we really care about you like we kind of like give a fuck you know so I just I want you to know, like, even though we don't talk every day, I really do care. Like, I care about our friends here. I care about your well-being. And I care about your mom, too. Like, so, even your cat. Or was it a dog? Do you have pets? I'm, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I had to. Well, because I have a feeling like sometimes you really don't think just because we don't talk as often 
as you like sometimes. I like I get that vibe. I feel like being by myself though, like, kind of gives me. And my one of my favorite words is like, so I'm not like stupid. I just like the word like, like a lot. But I feel like some people think just because. Now this is just me sending my face. I'm gonna try it this way. I'm gonna contour. Oh, this is the worst powder ever. And it always breaks up. My skin is really pretty. That's how it always is burnt. deep contour. My boyfriend is like hella introverted. So people are like, how the fuck are you and somebody's duh with the same person? That's her. Mm -mm. Just keep looking straight and you're like Yeah, just like that When I say blink, just It looks stupid, but It's really smart So, blink really don't understand like introverted people are introverted because I feel like we feel things so much more deeply and like we're more empathetic and also we can see through people's bullshit so when we can see through people's bullshit it's kind of like I know everybody is good for something but we would rather spend our time on good quality people that are well rounded Instead of having like a lot of people around that can do like some fake ass shit. That's how introverts are. That's how I am. And you know, I can't speak for everybody else because people are weird. So. I'm just telling you because I know not like everybody understands introverts. All I'm saying. I'm just rubbing for the set, so so to let you know. Especially because I feel like, like I said, your mom, low key, I love your mama. You know I love your mom, but sometimes I just feel so misunderstood. So, you know, just gonna brush out your eyebrows to get it. For this look too, I just want to put a little highlight all over your face um, and then I'm just going to put on some lip gloss. 
because I love your natural look. So I'm just gonna put a highlighter. all of what I said today because I just want you to know like no matter how long we go without speaking it's never intentional and I always feel the same about you like I just want you to know no matter what I always got your back like we got something you want to say like I always got your back so I just I never want you to feel like we're not as close just because we want to talk every day it's like the older I get the more I like kind of change I know a lot of my friends have said that about me before that I've changed, but it's because I am literally changing, like spiritually, emotionally, mentally. So I just want you to know, like, I'm still your ride or die, and just never count me out because I got your back. So, I'm gonna put some of this on, just. Okay. No, that's good. I was just, I was just kidding. I guess I'll see you like in another two years or whatever. I'm just kidding. I'm playing. So I'm happy I got a chance to see you today. And I promise I will call you more. And if I don't call you more, don't hold me to it because I probably won't. Even though I just said I would. So just know you're always on my mind. And even when I don't call you, just know you can always call me. And I will pick up every time. And that's a promise.